hey y'all hey y'all hey welcome back y'all already know for what a quick little video so y'all 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 already know your girl just been all over the place okay as usual all right we're gonna talk about our tough tony again real quick real quick I ain't gonna have y'all here real long real real quick um i listened to a phone call between Tough Tony and uh, Zola. And this call was very, very, very confusing to me. Now, Tough Tony has came on here <laughs> and told us that she has gotten herself a Jamaican me happy. That's what she said, okay? She said that she is truly in the best space that she's ever been in and she is deeply in love okay but if y'all go back and look at that pregnancy video that i had put up binge watching her pregnancies y'all will see every single time olivia gets with a new man she says the exact same thing every time every time it never ever fails so my thing is this tough tony um it's a few of us who i can say that we are quite confused we're not amused we are confused as always with you this shouldn't even be a surprise okay now what you told us is that you know what i'm saying you said well all of this stuff that's going on on youtube my man already told me sooner or later you know what i mean i'm not even going to be doing youtube okay so right there, you're saying that, you know what I mean, your man is going to stop you from doing it, and therefore, he got them coins, and is going to be able to take care of you. But we already know, at least I know, that you will never, ever stop doing YouTube. Okay? You will never, ever stop doing YouTube. If that's the case, and you will, and you bout it, all right, go ahead and stop doing YouTube for, say, the nine months of pregnancy and have you a sweet little jolly old time with your family you get what i'm saying and with you making me happy okay don't do no youtube don't do nothing the only don't even come up on the community tag you know daggone well that you will never ever do that because again you need youtube YouTube is the way that you put that you pay for that uh, vegetable oil that you put in them bottles and then go ahead and go outside on your uh, apartment lawn right there and get some of those rose petals, take them in the kitchen, have Stella with the boots, cut them up, put them in there, shake it up, and then put a label on it talking about, um, yeah, this is hair growth serum. serum. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you, that's not getting you nowhere. Those lashes that you have, they are not getting you anywhere either. And the reason why they are not is because I'm going to be honest with you. You are simply not a boss. You're not a boss at all. You are not a business-oriented, minded person whatsoever. And see, that is one of the reasons why you dislike Chrissy and me so much because they are really truly hustlers, okay? They may not always be put together business-minded, but they know a little bit of, you know, how to get them bags and to get them across. But see, you don't. See, I've watched you, you sat here, and you know what I mean, you have done OnlyFans. OnlyFans was supposed to go ahead and get you up on off of YouTube, and I can tell you right now, you ain't making nothing over there on OnlyFans whatsoever, okay? So you're not making nothing on OnlyFans. You're not making on anything on that oil that nobody wants to buy that is another YouTuber on here. If I could find a clip, she sells the same exact oil and did a review on your oil, okay? And hers is cheaper. Same exact oil. Mm -hmm. Y'all got it from the same exact place. Okay. So that's not working. And the last thing is completely not working. I'm going to be honest. 
I don't even know why people buy lashes from here when you can go inside the beauty store and get the same exact lashes with the same well packaged or even packaged better than what she's sending you. I don't understand it. Mm -hmm. So those are your trades. Is there anything else that you can do? Um, you can't do makeup because when you're a makeup artist, you have to be able to do every person's color. And see, if they throw a person in there like me with my complexion, girl, it, it will, your job will be over. Because I myself would make it over. I would give you the worst review. You would not be doing anyone's makeup except for Louie, your dog. That's the only makeup that you would be doing. Mm -hmm. So you can't do makeup. You can't come on to the camera and do like no cooking or anything because you cannot cook. Who can't cook? Oh, okay. Um, yeah, that's about it. Only thing that I can say that maybe you could go ahead and put out is, you know, you could do some internet modeling, you know what I mean? Giving sloppy toppy. Then you, you will be in the runner for that. I'm telling you, you'll be in the runner. But okay, let me get back. Let me get back. So my thing is this right here. So when I heard the actual phone call, what I wanted to know is because you said that Zolo, you caught him giving sloppy toppy to a Caucasian man in the front seat. You caught that. You said that you were not going to be taking care of him anymore because basically you were a younger sugar mama since you like to call the uh, the old lady sugar mama you are a younger sugar mama who was kicking out those coins for him buying him shoes buying him clothes buying him uh uh hemp weed okay buying bongs mm -hmm. um you, you 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 know you had to do all of that all right you said that you were catching him looking at other males on the phone and, and you know all of that. He even went to say that you know that you were on Cokey Coke and um, basically was trying to get your kids taken away from you. So my thing is, what I'm not getting right here is that, first of all, none of that would have went on over here. The first, none of that, none of that, okay? But you mean to tell me Everything that he is trying to do to you, that you will pick up a phone and you will call him or he can call you and you mean to tell me you literally sit there and actually talk back and forth with him? That, that, that right there, it, it, it throws me off. It's kind of weird. It's absolutely weird. Very weird. It's weird, 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 weird. It's about as weird as we don't know why you keep wearing those black leggings, okay? And that tie-dye romper. It's that weird. It's weird as in the sense of you are 30 years old and you cannot cook a meal except for tuna fish it's weird mm -hmm. it's weird and the whole time i'm like but you said that you got you know what i mean a boyfriend and you pregnant by him but yet you on the phone talking to zolo sounding like you know what i'm saying that you want him back like you have lost your best friend okay like you want to go ahead and scratch all your skin off, okay, so it can show Lorenzo's name on the side of your neck again. And you say, again, you're in love and um, that he watches your channel. I don't quite understand that. It makes me question, is this Zolo's baby or is this the invisible I uh, Jamaican me happy? I'm confused. Very confused. As all of everyone else is confused.
There's no way that I would have been on the phone with Zolo basically professing my actual feelings and love to him. Well, I, I loved you. You know how I loved you so much and you know how I helped you and did everything and, you know, gave you all of my money and, you know, gave you a YouTube channel and, you know, and um, you just basically, you just shit it on me and you left. Girl, you 30 years old, 30 years old, and you act like a 12 year old. A 12 year old. Zolo would not have been contacting me whatsoever. And if he did, but the difference with me and you, I have like a real, real, you know what I'm saying, straight up back, um, backbone, and I'm going to let you know what it is, and don't try me, okay, because what's going to happen now is I'm going to have to go and tell my cousin that, you know what I'm saying, that um, you keep contacting, you get what I'm saying, my phone, and then therefore they're going to go ahead and, you know, they're going to be whatever state you in at, they, they, they're going to be there. Okay, I would have had you making me happy. The guy that you said that is a right aid police, I'm sorry, not a right aid police. Um, a police, not a security guard. I would have had him, Zolo would have called, baby, can you pick that up? Because I'm not feeling good. The baby is just making me so nauseated. That's how I would be, girl. I would play this to the core. Okay, I would play it to the core right now, okay? Um, and I don't feel good. Can you please just, you know, it's stressing me out. He keeps calling my phone. And, you know, I'm just trying to be peaceful. I'm in love. I mean, I, it's just such a beautiful time for me. Yeah. But this is what makes me think that that is some bull. Because foreign men, yeah, listen to me. Clearly, they are very, very, very possessive. I know. Very possessive. Very. Now, they go ahead and take care of everything in the house, every single bill and more. Okay. And, 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 and whatever else. Because mine, I'm going to tell you right now, I just, you know, like, you might see a little twicker of like a little glass eye where a tear might be able to drop. And it's like, oh, what you need? You okay? All right, we can do this. I'm sorry. Yeah, I, mm -hmm, yeah. I go, I will play the part. Mm -hmm, sure do. Absolutely. Love being spoiled, okay? Mom, dad, cousins, brothers, you know what I'm saying? They, they all spoiled me, so therefore I grew up as a spoiled ass. Army brat grown woman yeah I, I sure did okay so that's what like confuses me because you wouldn't be on this camera saying the things that you say when you say that you got a good man who wants you to move in with him okay and who probably is going to make you stop doing YouTube you say and you over here worried about Zolo, which you said is a bum. He has no money. He has no nothing. He owns nothing. And I don't know why you said that because you own nothing. Everything you have, you ripped or either uh, you're, you're paying payments on it. A 2009, again, which is weird. I don't know nobody. They got a 2009 Mercedes that is still paying payments on it, okay? I don't know nobody. That Mercedes is old enough to vote. It's old enough if it was a kid to go to college. All of that. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. If I was you, I've said it over and over, I would look into getting historical tags, okay? 
um, since you know you love your car, yeah, get the historical ones. Go ahead and get you a blinged out rhinestone, you know, um, license cover. <laughs> get you a blinged out license cover and get the historical tags. Put one in the front, put one in the back. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying. You better not live. You better not still be paying no payments on that car. <laughs> You say it, you get what I'm saying, that, that, that you that, and, and, and you know what I'm saying, you drive a Mercedes and somebody else drives a Honda, okay? Oh, and live, let's not get it twisted either, live, let's not get it twisted. Mm -hmm. Your girl has a Honda too, I got a Honda, and I'm going to tell you, live, I love my little Honda, yes, I do, I love it, love it, love it, and guess what? Guess what, girl? It's a 19. And guess what? It's paid for. <laughs> so therefore, you over there talking about people that got Hondas that are paid for, and you got a 2009 Mercedes that ain't paid for. That's that weird stuff I'm telling you about, Liv. But yeah, so um, yeah, I didn't quite understand that whole call or whatever. I don't know if you and Zolo like in it to win it. Like, I mean, both of y'all weird, 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 okay? I know that you don't have no content. I know you are striving, you know what I mean? You over there on people, platforms. That, I mean, it's just a mess. It's just a mess. But you know what? I got to go ahead on and I got to take care of some stuff or whatever. So I'm going to see all you beautiful people and what? the next video later.